Okay, so a couple of videos ago, or a while ago in this case, I decided to reveal this devilishly ugly face, or bottom half of my face, to you guys, the viewers of this channel, whoever you are. Hi. And I decided, like the good Canadian motherfucker I am, that uh, a nice little toque and ski goggles, or in my case, mountain bike goggles, would be the way to go. So, that's exactly what I'm rocking. But today is a very special day. My first unboxing video of this parcel here. And. As you will see in the title below, yeah, yeah. If, so, okay. So, if you quickly exit out of full screen, right, there's a uh, little um, description down there, if if or title as well. If you look at that, it will say uh, unboxing and review of Hammer Strike. Yeah, yeah. Just take just take a quick yeah 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 yeah. No, ignore the subscribe button. Ignore that. Just just, just pay attention to the title. Okay. If you can't read, then hey, welcome to the same boat, because I can't either. It's a miracle that I can even spell out half this crap I can for titles. Hobby knife. <laughs> yeah, I'm just hacking. Oh, wow, it came neatly open. Unlike most, uh, I give this uh, Amazon packaging uh, uh, 10 out of 10 because I, it's not impossible to get into. down here okay um, you get this thing you get these this Ugh. instructions and hammer shot itself wow that's uh that's a very light prime. I was expecting something a little bit heavier. Dang. Oh, uh, I ignore the stuff onto the sides. That's a uh, that's a video for another day. And darts, aka uh, very expensive money drainers. This probably was like out of the. $25 I spent on this thing. Uh, I could have saved five bucks if they didn't include these darts. Fancy that. Dang, that feels really nice. Let's just, uh, my, uh, my first thoughts are, why the hell is there paint chipping? Why the, pardon me, paint chipping. Ah, oh, it doesn't matter. It's going to get checked around anyway. My first thoughts are very handsome. Uh, for I love I love orange. Orange is my favorite color. Uh, so I really I'm digging the orange. I kind of I really like the wood uh this wood grip here. It's really nice wood grip. Uh, the trigger is really nice. Uh, hammer. It's all right. I mean, it kind of digs into your thumb, but it's not the most annoying thing in the world, honestly. Easy to spin around. Woo, that's way easier than um, the uh, old school thing in the doohicker, that, which name I cannot remember. Very easy to spin around. Very compact, too. That's very nice. I really like that a lot. Got uh, one rail. 
up top. They should have included a rail underneath, honestly. That, that could have been a really cool thing, but I guess they, it's a good thing that they didn't because now we can shove on cool barrel accessories, which is something I am definitely going to look into. I am probably going to mod this thing. Not probably. I am definitely going to mod this thing. This, ooh, I really like this a lot. Uh, the only, like, gripe-ish thingy I have, I guess, would be the, uh, I mean, it's not really that big of a deal. It's part of the aesthetic is this tapey stuff on here. Grip tape. Um, I mean, that's like my only gripe with the zombie strike lines is like the weird grape, grippy tape stuff and like the weird like combinations of stuff and tools and stuff. Yeah, it looks like somebody did a rough job, but uh, this actually kind of, this is kind of schmexy. This is a really handsome Nerf Blaster. And it's definitely my favorite in the Zombie Strike line. Uh, I've wanted to get one, my hands on one of these for a while, so uh, I have one. This is sweet. I do not regret this purchase already. I already do not regret this pur purchase. This is awesome. This is so sick. And this is great for uh, if you have like a couple of dollars left on your Amazon gift card, you know? You know how you have like that like last couple of dollars on your Amazon gift card and you're like, what the heck should I did we do with this? Well, honestly, I'd go for one of these. <whistles> yeah, that's good. It's really good. Uh, one sling point. Ooh, that's really thin. That's going to, that's going to fit everything. That's awesome. Okay. Darts. Darts. I have not I have not unboxed a new blaster in over like like how many like three years it's been since I've had a new blaster in my hands to open. So this is exciting. Dang. Get rid of that packaging. It's a real shame that they couldn't have fit, like, one more barrel on here. I mean, like, see, um, look at all that space in between all the bores, you know? It's a real shame they couldn't have fit, like, a, um, a extra cylinder to make it six shots. Because I know this thing can handle up to, like, I'm pretty sure there's, like, an eight-cylinder mod that you can shove onto this thing. So, it kind of shocks me that you can't uh, do that with this, but hey, that's cool. That's fine. Let's, let's put these darts in, if I can, if my hands will let me. Maybe, just maybe, it might be possible. Alright. Oh, you can spin it. Definitely not good for Russian roulette, but yeah, whatever. Wow, okay. Jeez Louise. I was not expecting this. This looks, I mean, I'm not shooting at like, I'm shooting at a wall that's like two feet in front of me, but uh, Dang. I was not expecting that. There's, there's, there's hope. There's hope. Well, this, when this blaster came out, there was still hope that Hasbro knew what they were doing. Now I feel like everybody's a, go is adventuring to Adventure Force. Ah, uh, pun kind of not intended. I just realized that it was a pun the minute I said it. So everybody's starting to adventure towards the Adventure Force side of things because they have the things like the Pro. And honestly, if Hasbro came out with something like a Pro, that'd be good, but, oh man. Dang, this thing is cool. I'm, I'm really upset that I don't have one of these yet. I'm happy that I have one now. Dang. All their products presented in my videos are paid for by the, the lovely people paid for by my paychecks provided to me weekly by Metro. If you 
would like a Nerf blaster like this or any of the Nerf blasters in my said collection, then please get a job. Uh, I just thought, yeah, I might cut that out. Cheesy uh, sponsorship thing. Okay, let's do a shooting. Let's, let's, shooting time. We're shooting this thing now. Ah, uh, ah, uh, it's Clone Trooper Bob. Hi, Bob. Hi. Perfect. Okie dokie. Five shots. Um, shooting and crap darts and bad darts. I'm already liking where this is going. Dang, that's very good. Jeez. Headshot. Again, I gotta love the twirly twirly on this thing. Wow. If it shoots and strike that well. Very quickly now. Sh shooting to, um... Adventure Force Darts, or Adventure Good Darts. Oh. Very good. Very good. Alright. Uh, see you at the bench for Final Thoughts. Alright, welcome to Final Thoughts. Thoughts, final, final ideas, final thoughts. Who knows what I was intending to say. I don't even know. Uh, of the hammer shot? Hammer... Ha hammer thingamadoohicker. Uh, yeah. For a very, very light trigger hammer pull, like, I think this hammer pull might just even be a little bit lighter than a triad. I would love to dual wield these things. Dual wielding these would be sick. Very easy to flip. Okay. I love the colors. I love, I just love this blaster. But who are you say? Ah, that's so stereotyped. Everybody loves the hammer shot. Ah. Uh, yeah, I, was, uh, I wasn't sure either. Uh, I saw a lot of good reviews on this thing, but uh, I wasn't too sure what the big hype was all about. I mean, there's that. Super, super compact. Okay. It does, it goes the extra mile, that's for sure. Like, it has the performance you need from a blaster. Like, uh, I would definitely like that. I like that a lot. So, yeah, back to what I was saying. I wasn't too sure about this hammer shot. I really wasn't. I saw it in stores. I saw good reviews on it on YouTube and all that stuff. And I never picked it up. I was hesitant. I wasn't too sure if I was going to like this thing. I mean, there's so many good revolver things on the market. And nowadays, there's still all this uh, other stuff coming out. All this, like secondary party stuff happening that I wasn't too sure if this thing was going to hold up to what everybody was saying but now that I have my hands on it and and I've shot it I can see why people love this thing this thing is really cool this thing is really cool uh, I guess my only big gripes about it would be one thing. If you are loading a dart into the cylinder like this, is it going to fire? No. You have to load your darts in the cylinder before. So if you're running on empty, you have to load your dart here. 
And it doesn't sound like that big of a deal, but um, but uh, kind of is because your dart will not fire if you put it in this like most um, most revolvers up until now, as far as I'm aware, would had the cylinders misaligned like this so when you primed it which usually they were top primed you would prime it the cylinder would align when you fired and then go off you would prime pull half trigger would align it full trigger pull would fire the dart but in this case pulling the, it, the hammer back aligns the barrel and then you can fire just like that so I guess that's my only thing is that you have to do a little bit of thinking before you load this thing up in terms of when it's empty and so either yeah so just keep that in mind because I can see how that might be a pain in the neck one in a nerf battle in the heat of the moment type of problem uh, I guess I don't really have any other big gripes about this, other than uh, it would have been cool to see a, pick, a rail underneath here. That would have been something that may have been something that has been done. Um, I mean, the iron sights aren't half bad on this thing, to be honest. They aren't half bad. Ain't half bad. You could have probably gone away with putting a heavier spring in here, Hasbro, to start off with. But yeah, it it honestly is a kick-ass blaster, and I'm very happy with it. Uh, like, like you saw the first half of this video. That's the genuine article. That was my first time putting my hands on one of these things, so. Original reaction. <laughs> Come on, guys. I can't be lying if that's the first time I... You probably think I have another one of these, don't you? Well, guess what? Guess what? I don't. I don't. I don't. I just don't, okay? I'm sorry. I'm sorry to betray the Nerf community like that. It's a, it's a lie. It's, it's just... It's a lie. Betray the ner nerf community like that, but uh, yeah, this is my first one. Dude, this is so cool. Oh man. Oh man, but uh, yeah, I think that'll be it for this video. Uh, if you like this video, check out my other content. That like, that like button can win. Just shove that to the side. Go watch other content. Till the next time I see ya. I hope you enjoy video on the only channel that is more of a burden to watch than it is to subscribe to any other channel see you later peace